Hey guys, it's Star. I'm here recording another video and I'm inside my treehouse. It's nice up here. Sorry for your background noises. There's someone mowing their lawn right next to me. And I've got my sketchbook. And I've also, I've brought some stuff with me. Oh, I've brought my little art satchel. Oh my goodness, I can't even get anything out. <laughs> I brought the mistake, I, I brought, I made the mistake of not bringing a tripod with me. Cause I, didn't, I was too lazy. Ugh, I can't get it out. Oh. So, I have, <laughs> okay, so I have my fine liners and uh, a gel pen, uh, my pencil, and a eraser, and then a pencil sharpener and a bigger eraser down there. And then what I have in here is going to reveal what we are, well, well, what I am doing today. I've brought, oh my gosh, I brought my markers with me. Or at least some of them. It's not all of them. Because I couldn't get all of them to fit. So I took out all the dull colors and I put in some of my newer skin tone Copics that I got. So, yeah. I'm so happy I finally have Copics. And then the rest are just Prisma colors. New, old and new ones, so. Uh, if you can't guess what we're gonna do, I'm gonna do a three marker challenge uh, and try and draw at the same time. But first, we're we're not gonna pick the colors first. That way, I'm worried that if we pick the colors first and then I draw something, it's gonna influence I draw. So we're gonna put these away. We're not gonna use them yet. Actually, I'm gonna keep them up here because I don't want them to fall and then go through the cracks and then. Bye bye markers. <laughs> so. I'm just gonna use this. I was using a mechanical pencil, but I actually switched to this Faber Castell number two natural. It's an American natural. And it's just, it's lighter. So, and I have a really heavy hand, so it's like, it's, it's better for me to use a lighter pencil. So, I'm gonna start sketching something. You know, I, I've been drawing a lot of mermaids. So I might do like a mermaid girl. sort of thing. Can I apologize? So many background noises. See look, I'm already I'm very heavy hand and this is like a light pencil. Look at all the colors that's like a strobe light of like this it's windy. That's what. Oh yeah. You know I like drawing outdoors. It's very calming. I don't know about you guys, but drawing outdoors is really calming. Oh wait no I I, like I've been, I have been drawing a lot of like mermaid characters recently. I actually could show you one I was working on a couple nights ago. No, it was last night. Ah, I found it. I was drawing, trying to brainstorm some stuff last night. You know, just a mermaid character. I, first I was just kind of, this one I was just kind of brainstorming like her outfit and stuff and I came up with the idea to give her like kind of like a webby sort of ear so I think that's what I'm going to do to her. I like that idea. There. <laughs> it looks kind of weird. I don't know. You know, what, you know what, who cares. It's just a sketch. I need to give her another eye though. Maybe I'll have her like sitting down. That could work. You know what? I'm just gonna do like a little sketch. Oh, that's what I'm doing, duh. There we go. This is turning out a little bit better. Strobe light strikes again. I'll turn this way that way. I need, I'm, like, I've been trying to do, like, more full-body drawings just because I do so many icons, so many headshots, that I don't even know how to draw shoulders anymore. It's that bad. Oh, no, this just looks awkward. I can't get it right. Maybe some clothing would help. Maybe it'd look better with clothing. So right now, she's just... What the heck is my dog doing? Hank! What are you up to? Okay. 
He was literally just spinning in circles, just like going bonkers. And I'm like, what is that noise behind me? Uh -huh. Rock. Okay, that looks cute. She needs another ear though. <laughs> That'd be helpful. I wonder if I have some sort of jewelry in her hair. I could give her like some sort of like crown. Some sort of majestic crown. So that look alright. Let's put some shells like right here. Like I'm acting like I'm just making a full illustration. This is just a three marker challenge. <laughs> Lots more pillows. Windstorm! I don't know if you guys can hear that. Oh my gosh. So I think I finished the sketch. Time to ink it. Okay, so I went over basically the mermaid again while off camera because, I mean, I doubt you guys wanted to see me go over nine arch for a second time. I think there's something in my foot. I mean, in my in my shoe. Oh, no, there isn't. I was just itching. Okay. So now, the time has come where we pick the markers to do this. I'm just going to put this away because we do not need this anymore. We now need... Ugh. This. You can trust me, I have my eyes closed. So I'm basically just mixing it around. It's kind of hard to mix it around. It's literally so packed. It's packed so tight. Okay. Uh, this one. This one. And let's go for something on the edge. This one. Oh gosh. Okay, these three colors. At least they look good together. You can say that. So I have Prismacolor. Come on, zoom. Zoom. Focus, please. Well, if you can't read what that says, that's a Prismacolor art marker. PM6 Scarlet. And then we have another Prismacolor. We have PM36 Lime Green. And then we have a Prismacolor Premier, which has the brush, which I'm very happy about. And this is Deco Orange PB130. Fancy, fancy. Okay, so that's the green color, that's the red color, and that's the orange color. <sighs> I don't know if I should do this. Oh my goodness. I don't know what to do. I mean, how am I, why did I even do the bubbles? Because, I mean, it's going to be like an awkward color. Either she's going to be swimming in like really dirty water and then, I don't know. I'm like, I can, I don't know. Well, first I'm guess I'm, I should just start off on what I know I'm going to do, which is the green. Which I know I'm going to color a seaweed. Because, I mean, I don't want the chisel tip. I work so difficult, I, I, I cannot do chisel tip. I've tried and I failed. It's just too big and I can't get it right. So we might as well just start on something that we know we're gonna do. I can't 
camera will not focus. So there's the seaweed. So I'm gonna put this away for now. You know, I think I have decided I want to do her hair in this color. Cause I mean, it has the brush tip and I love drawing hair and brush tips. So I think I'll do that. hair I'm still kind of a noobish at blending this kind of stuff so please don't judge me I'm trying to learn um, I'm gonna wait for that to dry and then I'll go over it again so until then I think I'll just get the red out you know what I think I'll do like these little golden things like that and then I'll do like that little thing green I don't know. I'm like leaving out the red. I have no idea what to do with the red. I have honestly no idea. I could do a red streak in her hair. Maybe. Maybe if I'm building up to it, maybe I will. Maybe. Okay. So now to her top. I want that to be that color. Okay. Okay, let's see how this turns out. Ah! Okay. No, I could have done something striped, but no, I have to go straight into it. Darn, I could have done a striped thing and then it looked so cool. Oh well, what happened happened. Can't go back now. Okay. Now here comes the question about what to do with her eyes. Do I want to do them green? I just want to keep going with the red. I don't think I want to do the red. No, I'll do green. Because, I mean, I think yellow or red would look kind of too, like, evil. So we'll do green. There's that. Oh my god, she like just doesn't want to focus. Just freaking focus. You know who cares? Okay, so that's her so far. I need to figure out something with her tail. I mean the red top is just kinda like out there, like, oh yeah. So oh I may do the sheet the the blah 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 blah. blah. The sea sail real <laughs> the seashells like kind of um that color but yeah i think i want to do her tail green or should i do it yellow or the orange color oh i don't know because i'm afraid green is gonna be too much green 
But then again, I could do her tail like a bunch of different colors. Okay, I'm doing a green. I think I'm gonna do the tail this, uh, I don't know what I wanna do. You know what, I'm gonna do it. Maybe I can leave like the edges a little bit white and just have it like this mango tail with like a little bit of white. I wonder if that would look all right. We'll try it. So if it doesn't look good, I can always just cover it back in with um, the full color. Uh, I don't know. No, I'll outline it in that now. I'm sorry for all the light. It's like all of a sudden the sun starts to set. It's like, oh, hi there. This doesn't look bad. It kind of looks like those butterflies, like the butterfly wings. I don't know what butterfly it is, but... It doesn't look bad. No, no, it doesn't. And we'll do the seashells red. And, like, and if you wonder what those little circle things on her tail is, it's kind of like almost like how, like, you know, people pierce their ears. That's kind of how it is. Like, it's kind of like jewelry sort of stuff on her tail. Um, yeah. Okay, I'll do the seashells next to her red. Because, I mean, I need a little bit of pop of color. Yeah. Okay. So now I'll just start shading. Okay, all done. Whoa, <laughs> I'm just kind of prepped. Okay, done, bye. <laughs> oh gosh. I'm just signing this. Mm, let's sign it with a 0.50. My ah, It's fun. Yay. And then the date is, oh gosh, what is today? I think it's the 6th. And six month, seventh day, the 2016th year. Yaha, I did it. Be proud of me. There's the finished illustration. My finger slipped and I stopped recording. How professional. Anyway, there's the finished illustration. Why should I give her freckles? I need to give her freckles. That'd be so cute. Okay. Mission accomplished. There's just freckles. I think she looks cute. Yeah. I mean, I don't know about it. I don't know what about it. I think almost every artist can relate to this. As soon as you finish drawing it, you just absolutely hate it. And that's how I feel like right now. Like, I like it and I hate it at the same time. Like, I want to throw it out the window and never see it again. That's how life works. Yeah. Thanks for joining me. Oh, look at the tree. Oh, I how much I can zoom in. Oh, I can keep going. I can keep going. I didn't know I could keep doing this. Can it go anymore? Okay, bye. I'm gonna go now. We'll climb down the stairs and go eat something because I'm hungry. I decided to go down the slide. Probably gonna regret this. I'm probably gonna regret this, but. Where I go? I'm never gonna be I'm gonna survive this for the life of me. I'm holding literally five things. I'm holding my sketchbook, I'm holding this, and I'm holding my camera. And if I fall, look how far down that is. Ooh. Fall, you die. That's how it goes around here. Okay, here I go. Ah! I did it. Be proud of me.